My world's so bright It's hard to breathe But that's alright Hush What is going on guys? I'm back with another video I hope all of you guys are having an amazing day I hope all of you guys are safe out there Anyways, in this video, we're going to be playing this Giant Devil Prince deck, which mostly all of you guys know this deck already. It consists, of course, of the Giant and Devil Prince and the Miner to chip away at your opponent's towers. You have the Fireball and Zap as your two spells, the Electro Wizard for Sparkies, Inferno Dragons, or other things like that, and the Mega Minion as your big DPS dealer. And yeah, guys, this deck is an absolute beast of a deck. So, like, if you guys need a deck to win games in Clash Royale, make sure to pick up this deck today. And yeah, look, before we get into some matches today, look, I just wanted to say, please hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. My goal is 500 subscribers before the end of 2020, so make sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And help me reach my goal, 500 subs, guys, giveaway included once we hit 500 subs, so hit that subscribe button. Make sure to give this video a like if you do enjoy. And other than that, let's get into some matches and let's try to win with this Giant Double Prince deck. Okay, so we found the game here versus this guy. I think I just want to minor the f the furnace just because um that furnace gets super annoying if you guys have played with it. Let's fireball down his magic archer. Like always, guys. And yeah, this guy has furnace, magic archer. I don't know why he's going to play a cannon car in the bridge, but hey. That prince should go directly to the tower. He's still going to have to defend the prince. Maybe with the skeleton army. Nah, he's going to play a goblin cage, which is which is good for me. And yeah, look, I think I want to go all in just because he wasted his goblin cage. Now he doesn't have his goblin cage for my giant. And let's see what he decides to do. He has goblin cage bomb tower. What the hell? What? We can miner on top of his dark goblin. And yeah, this guy is not playing smart at all. Nah, this guy. This guy is not playing smart at all. We can... um, We can hopefully bring his king tower to... To half HP, but no. And yeah, this guy does not know what he's doing, bro. I do. This guy does not know what he's doing. Let's drop over Dark Prince. And what are you going to have, my guy? Or did this guy just give up? He's going to have cannon car. I mean, yo. Yo, look, what does... Why does this guy keep on playing cannon car, man? This guy is not good at the game, I think. I don't know. I think his only troops are cannon car and magic archer. That's all. And apart from that, he has bomb tower. Oh, goblin barrel as well? Okay, man. Okay, I see you. But yeah, let's just build up the biggest push of the century. Let's drop off a giant. And the double. No, oh my. This is about to get spicy up in here. Giant double prince, guys. This is what the deck is made for. Giant double prince. Yeah, you can drop off cannon car on the, on the left side. I don't really care about that. I forgot he has two buildings. Damn. But now we can drop off another giant. We can drop off another prince. And this should be GG's, boys. This should be GG's. Yeah, we can fireball down the the Dark Goblin and Magic Archer, which I didn't even need the fireball, bro, because the Prince had it already. But hey, I'll take this three crown, nice and easy three crown of this against this guy. Oh, I'm so mean. I didn't even let him take out the tower on the left side for his crown chest. I mean, for his crowns, for his tears. But hey, nice and easy dub. We got another game against this man right here. And I can zap this tower if I would like, but I don't feel that vibe right now, you know? So, like, what are you going to have, my guy? What are you going to have today? You're just going to play a Lumberjack in the bridge. That seems like a pretty interesting play, in my opinion. A Skeleton Army, some bats? Who Bowler. You don't usually see Bowler these days, or do you guys? I mean, I don't see Bowler these days. Like, I don't know if you guys see Bowler. But we can destroy his Bowler with our Prince. He dropped off a Baby Dragon all the way in the back. 
And what are you gonna have? Scar me? Barber, okay. He's still gonna have to respond to this prince, right? Freeze, what? I think this guy has no elixir whatsoever. Yeah, he has no elixir to defend that. While I have elixir to defend the balloon. We can fireball back the balloon. So the balloon doesn't get one single shot off our tower. We can even zap his inferno dragon to reset that thing. And yeah, his tower is going down. His <laughs> This guy overspent it with the balloon. And yeah, guys. No, the inferno tower is going to melt my tower. Don't take out my whole tower. Oh. 514 hell what the infernal dragon just melted down my whole tower which is unfortunate i should say but hey look at least it didn't take out my whole tower which is good there's still 500 hp left on that tower guys don't worry and i'm still not gonna make look i'm still not gonna let him take out my whole tower if that balloon doesn't get a shot yes sir let's go this drop of a dark prince and the electro wizard because I know he's going to go inferno dragon anytime now or like that's what I hope he would do but it looks like he's not going with inferno dragon huh which sounds pretty weird yeah you can freeze all day man we can giant prince on the king tower side and hopefully 3k on this man right here because yeah look I don't yeah look I don't think he has nothing to stop that let's zap his inferno dragon this time to retarget it Let's fireball his lumberjack, infernal dragon, and the tower. And just like that, I think we 3 crown him, boys. <laughs> yeah. The prince is just a beast. Anyways, we pick up a nice and easy dub against this bowler freeze deck. Okay, so we got a match against this man right here. And look at his clan. He is a noob, I think. He is a noob. Let's drop off in in an electro wizard and dark prince just so the wall breakers won't connect. <laughs> I hate this deck, bro. Damn. Does anybody else ha hate Mega Knight? Please, please make sure to leave it down in the comments below, dude. I just don't like playing against Mega Knight, bro. Who else is like me? You just don't like Mega Knight. Who else thinks the Mega Knight needs a nerf? Cause I do. The Mega Knight needs a nerf, man. And when I mean a nerf, just like not a little tiny nerf. Damn, Mega Knight, bro. <laughs> did I miss the wall breakers? Oh, let's go. I didn't. Let's go. Don't tell me that mini pick is going to get off a shot. No. Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, my God. I didn't time the Mega Minion right, I think. If I shouldn't time that correctly, then the mini pick should have not get off a shot. But hey. At least we made him bait out bats though. So yeah, that's good. And what do I want to do here? Yeah, just cycle a, a giant in the back. Play a prince in the back, I think. Behind the giant. Yeah, you can go wall breakers, miners any day of the week. I'm just going to ignore that, my guy. And yeah, guys, this should be tower right here. Wait, never mind. He has the Mega Knight. Freaking Mega Knight. Yeah. <laughs> Just. Oh my. That Mega Knight gets annoying, boys. But look at that giant going ham on the tower. He still has to drop off a mini P.E.K.K.A. too. Like, just so that Dark Prince won't hit our tower. I mean, his tower. And yeah, guys. We're going to fireball down in the last possible second. To get the Miner and Wall Breakers. Like, oh. Oh, we were so close to activating King Tower. That is unfortunate. But yeah, this guy is just going to do the same thing. Cycle the Musketeer in the back. And we can Miner the Musketeer once the Giant crosses the, the river. Let's Miner now, guys, right? Now? Yeah, now is a good time. Oh, he played the Mini P.E.K.K.A. Which is unfortunate, but hey. At least we fireball down the Mini P.E.K.K.A. and the Musketeer, which is good. And let's see, can we break through here? Or is he going to play a Mega Knight? I'm like, I'm like, I don't think he has a Mega Knight right now. Look. Right, guys? Look, I don't think he has a Mega Knight right now, like, in rotation. 
Let's play a Dark Prince. Let's play a Giant. In front of that Prince, hopefully. Oh. Prince, why did you go freaking first, man? Dude, like, can't you be a little bit slower? And not that fast? <laughs> but hey. The Giant will finish the tower off. And just like that, we we beat this Mega Knight player. Who else, is, who else hates Mega Knight, bro? Just delete the card in the game. Delete it. Okay, guys, we found the game here against Green Giant. I mean, look, our giant is not green, but hey, look, it's a giant, though. <laughs> this guy is going to have the furnace, which quite a few people are using right now just because the furnace got buffed. I mean, look, let me know in the comments if you guys are using the furnace. But, oh, we got two giants up in this thing. So he's also going to have a giant of his own. But let's see what kind of cards does he have with this giant. If he has... Oh, he is going to have bomber. Okay. That's not the best. I mean, but hey. Let's let's destroy the bomber with my miner. And hopefully that giant can take out the furnace. Because that furnace gets annoying. That furnace gets annoying. Oh, it wasn't able to do so. But hey. It is what it is, boys. At least my miner was able to take out his bomber. Which is good. Because guys... Another card that's annoying in the game, if you guys have faced it before, is the bomber. The bomber is annoying, right guys? Or am I wrong there? The bomber is annoying. But hopefully I timed the, the Mega Minion there so the Mini P.E.K.K.A. won't get off a shot. Ah, oh, That hurts. That hurts, boy. <laughs> it's never good for a Mini P.E.K.K.A. to hit your tower, bruh. It's never good. But yeah, dude, this is what I mean when Furnace is annoying. This is what I mean. The Fire Spirits just keep on taking down your tower bit by bit. And the Furnace gets super annoying, bro. But this guy just gave me a lot of Electra because he wasn't dropping off anything. And since he wasn't dropping off anything, the guy was gaining Electra. And he was still at the same Electra. Let's zap Fireball his mini... I mean his... His bomber and musketeer. The giant's on the tower. Which is what I like to see. Yes, sir. Freaking giant, bro. Look, you need to stop eating pizza, man. You need to stop eating pizza, giant. You're too fat. <laughs> what the hell? We can drop off a giant. Let's miner on top of his musketeer. And yeah, hopefully that musket goes down. We don't want to see no musketeers today. Yeah, I think this is... Yeah, look, this is looking like our game, guys. This is looking like our game, but like, I don't want to jinx it too right now. Because you never know in Clash Royale, guys. You never know. But, yeah. I think this match is ours, guys. Yeah. Double Prince on top. Yeah, this guy doesn't know what he's doing no more. He's like, what do I do with this situation? Look at all that stuff that's coming at him. We can even minor his King Tower, bro. <laughs> Double Prince is just insane. Three Prince on the map. Four Princes. <laughs> If we had a little bit more time, we could have three crowned him. But hey, I'll take a nice dub against another giant player. Let's go. That will be the end of the video today, guys. Once again, here is this giant double prince deck, which is an absolute beast of a deck to use in Clash Royale. Make sure to try out this deck and let me know how it goes for you in the comments down below. And other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please make sure to leave a like. Subscribe to my channel if you are new. I'm trying to hit 500 subs before the end of 2020. So make that happen, guys. 500 subs. You already know the vibes. I really, really do appreciate the support, guys. Whether it's by watching my streams on Twitch or watching my videos on YouTube. I really, really do appreciate the support. I can't thank you guys enough. And other than that, I hope all of you guys have an amazing, wonderful rest of your day. Keep on spreading those positive vibes. Make sure to check out all my socials and check out my Twitch where I try to stream every day for you guys. So make sure to give me a follow on Twitch if you would like. And check out my merch, all that good stuff, Discord, Insta, Twitter. And other than that, I'll catch you guys in the next one. I can never ever find the right words. And there's no way this is real life. There's no telling you're the right girl. So I can only say that it feels right. It feels right. It feels right. Yeah, I can only say that.